my name is Malikar, nice to be you and welcome back to Tales of Berseria. Ride my ship, sometimes I forget about you. Scout ships. There we go, bye. Oh my god, let's go. I was like, I won't play today, but I cannot not play today because we're in the Morgan Woods. God damn it, dog, stop it. Let's see what really went through. Maybe I didn't devour them. Maybe I just removed them. Maleficent, Maleficent. Oh my god. How are you doing now? I don't think we have a chance. No escape. You're not hurt, are you? No, I'm fine. <laughs> Oh my god, I love you so much. I'm just seeing if there is a treasure chest. So I, I normally don't do that. Let's be honest. I normally don't do that. I just walk because I, I'm just desperate. In a very good way, like... Like, the story just captured me. That's so very bad, I want. Let go. Woo! It's a biggie! <laughs> I'll cut down anyone in my way. You tell them, girl. You tell them, girl. Well, I'm the one cooking, but you're the one eating. Oh, okay, okay. Sure. Whatever you want, whatever you want. Who could have jump that distance, you know? Why right there are a lot of ogres? Oh no 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 Let's go for two. Are we ready for this? Oh, damn it. I love when he screams that. I was going through here, so since I'm already walking, never mind, there's nothing. Ah, oh, you? I fought a lot of you people. 
Never mind, I cannot jump. Ah, oh, of course, it was the other way. And I didn't remember it. Let's just go to the village. Oh, yeah, yeah, I fought you guys back there. Alright, there are two. Okay, we're good of fighting because we're winning. So we are balanced. Is there a big empty space? God damn it, I don't like big. Oh, never mind. Okay, two. Are we ready for this? For one! 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 What? She died? What the hell? We're all good and you die. Oh my god, guys. Put up some fight, okay? Maggie, how did you die? Really, Velva, you're dying. And the dog is barking. I know. I know. Never mind. I cannot use it. I need to use it. Oh god damn it, the dog. Oh, shut up. <sighs> Maggie, really, how did you die? Engage at range, rescue, um, target multiple enemies, rescue allies in danger. I think now it's better. The hell are you? Ah, you're the coco, 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 Oh, dogs, shut up. They're not even my dogs. Where is the freaking village? Ah, okay. God damn it, really, why are they barking? They need to bark now, like, right now. Not later, no, 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 later there is no bark. God damn it, shut up. <laughs> you guys are like, we are, we cannot hear anything. We're there, wait. Maybe if I do this and this, maybe. I don't know. Uh... Oh. Nico! For what? What's going on? How can Nico be here? For what? For what? Is it hard? Oh, pressure! God damn it! Alright, the dog stop it. Who stays when get feed? Who stays when feed? 
through space, wing it B. He doesn't like fire, right? I think he doesn't like fire. No fire anymore? Huh. time you just up and disappeared everyone thinks that you were eaten by a demon but i knew it couldn't be true you're too strong to let some crummy demon take you down you're alive <laughs> Sorry, 
I, I, I didn't mean to embarrass you in front of your friends. I have to let everyone know the good news. You finally come back to us. Nico's alive. She's alive. Don't let your guard down. I've got a bad feeling about this. Well, naturally, we've got a Reaper with us. <laughs> Let's head for a ball. We can ask everyone there exactly what happened. Y yeah. I think I think what 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 Maggie say like we'll... Velvet. I have to ask. Are you sure that the other villagers died that day? Well, it's it's not like I had time to check. Or she took the malevolence line south of them with her hand? Or the sacrifice of Luffy said made them back, but they were some dead. Or the thing of Magilo gonna come. Like, where am I even going? What is that way? Wait, wh where am I going? Eastern Morgana, Eastern Morgana Woods. The same thing. I'm just confused. Can I jump that way? I could not jump that way. Oh, maybe it's not this way after all. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Let me jump. No. Okay. Ah, oh, there is somebody. Okay, no. Don't touch me. Okay. Hmm. Well, but Maggie did say that, like, maybe your happiness, the good thing, is the one that crumb will crumble you. Maybe this will be it. Maybe now I need to kill them. Truly. Even if they may be fake. Maybe all of... <gasps> maybe all of them are Darians. Oh my gosh. Could be. Could be. Hmm. 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 We're into something, girl. We're into something. Which... Dude, I don't remember my home. Really, I don't remember my home. Is this way? No, no, this is not the way. Of course, because there is no village that way because it's a dead end. Is this way? My village? Hello? Okay, there is a chest. Ah, a cat chest, but there used to be a chest here. What? Give me something. Look, fuck you. I guess uh, find all the cat chests to find all the accessories. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh my gosh. Village, where are you? This can't be. After what I did. When he killed Luffy. Velvet. Are you all right? Of course I'm all right. I know I'm right. I'm sure of it. This isn't how the village should be. Well, let's stay calm and investigate. I am calm. I'm fine. Really. It didn't seem like that was someone else masquerading as this Nico girl. But if she's the real thing, then something very unnatural is going on. You get me, Rokuro? Yeah, we better keep an eye out. Oh, they are them. Okay, they they told me about this. So. Okay, thank you, thank you. Now, where's my village? Where's the star? I know. <laughs> oh no 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 no. Wrong way, wrong way. I know, I saw the chest, but wrong way. I'm lost right now. And when I'm lost, I get impatient. Because I want to be found. Not to be lost. Uh, big empty space, nothing. Okay, good. It's good that Tails is not like a big empty space. Something will happen. <laughs> well, a safe point is kind of like something will happen. Yeah. It looks like my village... Ah, there. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Thank you. Now you just run. There should... The, look, the monster did change here. And there is a safe point to my village. With who I'm gonna fight. Oh, I'm gonna go to my house. And maybe the true book is there. Maybe there is gonna be the explanation of all these things going on with me. 
Oh my gosh. For a moment I thought it was muted. Velvet! You're really alright! Oh, thank heavens! It's so good to see you! Where have you been all this time? You never even wrote! But... I don't... I... I thought the whole village was wiped out that day. Yeah... It nearly was. But just when we thought it was all over, Arthur, Lord Artorius saved us! No! It was his doing in the first place! He sacrificed Lafayette! It really was a shame what happened to that poor boy. That's all you have to say? A shame? My brother Loppy died I'm that- I'm sorry. Truly, I am. But you can't lose hope, dear. He's right. What counts is that your brother's still alive. <laughs> He's... alive? They He's are the brother? in your house. Don't worry, we've all pitched in to take care of him. Uh... I don't... Velvet. <laughs> Is he... Is Velvet. he... Velvet, let's go to your house and see. Yeah. Luffy... Luffy's alive? Maggie Lou. What's wrong? <laughs> <laughs> well, that didn't break it. Next time you suspect an illusory art, test out your theory on yourself. You think we're all seeing an illusion? It's possible. It wouldn't be the first time. But an entire village? That shouldn't be possible. Shouldn't be, no. How do we approach this? Try to break it apart at the seams somehow? No. For now, we and our enemies share the same goal. Come on, help me look for the Therian. Sure. I think I'll stick with Velvet. I won't stop you. Keep a close eye on her. I don't think she's entirely right in the head at the moment. Yeah. Oh my god, did they even show me the love he said? Oh, who else is with me? Okay, well, the girls. Maggie, of course. <laughs> Maggie, I freaking love you. She knows. She knows the stuff. She knows what's up. Oh, the graveyard. My home. It hasn't changed a bit. We need to be careful, Velvet. Aizen thinks this could be a trap. You think Nico and everyone are being controlled? I don't know. Oh, what it's Maggie just... said. That the you happiness think it could, could be, be the problem. Doing. But even so. <sighs> it's not going to work on me. You're insane. People can fight against pain, but... Is she like... <sighs> I won't be deceived by this. You'll open your wound! <gasps> You're warm! Luffy, you're really alive. Then why your sister isn't alive? Luffy, he's been asleep ever since that day. Oh. I found him at the shrine, collapsed on the ground. The his soul. His wounds healed, but he's never woken up. If he's still alive, that's all that matters. I'll find a way to wake you again, Luffy. I swear I will. We'll be together. I still have to thank you for this comb after all. So that's where Velvet's comb came from. I'm like, just don't try to terrorize. Let the story tell Did me on my Lord face. Did Lord Artorius really try to sacrifice such a defenseless child? What's wrong, Lafayette? 
You don't look like your usual perky self. I'm... I'm okay. I'm just glad Velvet's all right. What? Your name is Lafayette too? <laughs> what a weird coincidence! Uh, yeah. Hey, sorry about all that, you guys. Don't worry about it. What are we going to do now? If it were me, I'd make Lafayette said something he really likes for dinner tonight. He can handle soup. Maybe he'll notice the smell of your cooking and it'll wake him up. Yeah, maybe I should. Would you watch after him while I go buy what I need? Of course. I am at your beck and call. Is there anything I can do to help too? Yes, please. I'll need you to be my taste tester. I wonder if they've located the Therian. Let's just leave that to them. You're not curious? Of course I am. But for right now, I want to stay close to Velvet. I've got a really bad feeling about this. Something more important than finding the Therian? Yeah. My stomach is twisted, and I've got a chill up my spine. I'm really scared. Very well. I trust your feelings. We'll leave the Therian to Rokuro and Aizen, and stay with Velvet then. Thanks, Eleanor. Magilu, what will you do? Whatever I feel like. <laughs> <sighs> I shouldn't have asked. Thanks anyway, Magilu. Are you sure you're doing the right thing? Oh. In the end, whatever happens, happens. Wiser words never spoken, right? All right. First, I'm going to whip up my special quiche. Oh my and God. then I'll throw in tomato and egg soup and some pudding. I didn't even know your face had smile muscles. Magilu, okay, okay. Oh my god, Magilu, I love you. I uh, yet I don't know. Okay, let's see. Um, beside the grave mark for Artorio, Aselica's unborn child stays the gravestone of Velvet's parent and her sister Celica. Incribed upon the teeny pillar are the following words: "The little life will spread its wings and soar through the skies." Oh my god, I don't want to terrorize. Uh, trying to understand right now. No. I'm hearing things. Well, ah, okay. Well, we know what to do. For now. <laughs> I'm like, well. Keep up, or I'll leave you. I mean, if we are, oh my gosh. It's been a long time, hasn't it, Velvet? I wanted to apologize to you for ages now. Apologize? What for? That business with Arthur. Back then, I said he seemed like a fraud. I know you took it pretty hard, but if he wasn't there three years ago, our village would have been destroyed. I'm sorry I doubted him. I didn't trust him then either. I only realized how amazing of a person he was when he saved all of our lives. <sighs> I'm ashamed of myself. All this time we've been feeling terrible, thinking we may have driven you to leave the village. Please, forgive us. That's not... I, I didn't... Where have you been these past three years? It must have been tough living on your own without any family to help you. Sorry, you don't have to talk about it if it hurts. But if you ever feel like talking, we're here for you. I know we can't make up for all the pain we put you through, but if there's anything we can do, just ask. And if you'd like, you're always welcome to come back. The whole village would welcome you with open arms. Look, I don't want no open arms. I did right, there was a chest. Ha 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 ha. Between the cold, the famine, and the demon blight, there were times I thought the world was done for. But, over the past three years, I've stopped worrying. I know we're overly reliant on Arthur and the Exorcists, but this village has changed. The Exorcists taught us that there are things the demons hate. We can't defeat them, but we can keep them away. 
It's peaceful now. Exorcists stop by on patrol every now and then, and we haven't had a case of demon blight since what happened to your sister was horrible. But you and Lafayette should try to move on. Make the most of your lives. I hope he wakes up soon. I'm sure he will. Maybe Arturis tried to do whatever he did with the sister and the unborn child didn't work. And with the Lafayette did work. Velvet! It's been forever! Great to see you! You haven't changed a whit! What do you mean by that? <laughs> have you seen Nico yet? I have. She's as full of life as she always was, right? Come to think of it, nothing's really changed much, has it? I suppose not. By the way, how are Orthy and Russ doing? Those pups haven't changed a whit either. They saw a guy with a big sword walking with a dour-eyed fellow in black. They freaked out and hightailed it. That would be Rokuro and Aizen. Those dogs are as cowardly as always. So, what part of Velvet hasn't changed a whit? Hmm. She doesn't have any makeup on? Uh-huh. The coming of the Malachim are a gift from the Empyreans. A reward for our repentance and our renewed prayers. The Malachim are our blades against the demons and the exorcist the hands that wield them. Humanity's hope. You never change. Want me to take you home this time? No! Don't treat me like I'm senile! Ah, uh, okay. Oh! It's you, Velvet. Be careful when fighting Pricklebores. If they charge you, punch them in the nose, right? No! Throw sand in their eyes! <sighs> sand in the eyes. Got it. You finally started listening to me. You're 16. You've really grown. Yeah. 16? But aren't you 19? Leave her be. Excuse me? <laughs> can I open the chest? Oh yeah, I can. Hey. Could I get some eggs, milk, spinach, and tomatoes? And I'd love to know what cheese you'd recommend, too. You got it. And in celebration of your homecoming, I won't even charge. With you cooking up a feast like that, I'm sure Laffy Set will wake up straight away. Thanks. I really appreciate it. You're getting spinach? I can't really handle it myself. You'll never grow up strong if you don't eat your spinach, young lady. I've done just fine without it so far, thank you. <laughs> oh, if you insist, I'll leave it out just this once. Wow, Velvet, you must be special. Not many folks get to be friends with an exorcist. She's, She's not, not my, my friend! friend. <laughs> <laughs> the way you two bicker, I find that hard to believe. Oh, yeah. Do you have any prickle bore? Oh, I'm sorry to say that I'm out at the moment. That's fine. I'll hunt some up myself in the tranquil woods. Just like old times. Actually, there haven't been any prickle bores there lately. You should try the Morgana Woods instead. Okay, I'll do that. Thanks for the tip. You don't like spinach, right, Eleanor? Well, you know, I just... All right, it's true, but keep that between us, okay? Velvet really seemed to be enjoying herself at the shop. Quite. And she can really pick out a nice balance of foods while making every gulp count. She seems so cheerful and carefree. That's the real Velvet. I'm sure of it. Yes. An ordinary, dutiful, loving sister. I wish she could have stayed that way. She could have lived a happy life, surrounded by her friends. Just plain Velvet Crow, sister to Lord Artorius. Uh, and maybe not Lord Artorius, but just plain Arthur. A happy, ordinary life for an ordinary girl, with a kind family and supportive friends. Oh, Maggie Lou, I thought she was going Alrighty. to appear. To the Morgana Woods to hunt some prickle boars. Yeah, sure. Which way? Okay. <laughs> I'm like. Why? Okay, I'm. I'm. I'm scared, girl. Dude, I'm. I'm also having that sensation that they're. It's a lot going on right now. It's a lot going on. Uh, so I don't see pickleboards here. 
I don't see them here. Are they leading me to a trap? Like, I got like four people going for pickaboards. <laughs> ah, there, the star. <laughs> We're looking for prickle boars. Keep your eyes on the thickets. Dude, it's so strange to see available like this. Wow, what a game. What a game. Ooh. Like, you should be happy, but you got the ominous feeling. What the hell? Where's the pickup blur in this place? Hey! It says here. Ah, I saw it. I saw it. Okay, but don't don't run with that dot. I'll show you the beauty of my firework. Not even worth my time. I mean, they're pickaboard. This is hunting. <laughs> we keep this. Are we ready for this? How many will bring home? You won't get a word. Hey, hey. Got you. Slow down. No mercy! Wounds that won't heal! Cards into flesh! Lethal pay! Clear off! Take that! Devour! Make a sonic You won't get a word! Blood Devour! Make a You won't get a word! Blood it's guardian was was angry at it hold on you can read a guardian's heart um yeah sort of uh okay okay i'm like inside me i'm like come on hurry up hurry up How are they hunting these people if there are demons around? Monster, well. Okay, they are not demons, they are monsters. They are monsters, right? No kind of demons. Oh my god, no. No, 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 no. So I go to my house, right? I got everything. I don't need anything more. Let me let me take my where where could it be? Where is it? Ah here. Okay. I got everything now. But wait, what else? On for pick of war. How many do you want? How many do they want? Do I, do I hunt for more? Wait, do I, do I hunt for more? That's what they want. Me to hunt for more. You could have said that. Like this quantity, three? Did they say the quantity? Maybe three, which could be. Excuse me. Okay, no pick a ball. Oh my god, go away. No pick a ball here. Not here neither. Okay, open the chest. God damn it. I'm like, you're already searching for pick a ball, and there are chests in front of you that you just don't want to walk and pick it. Oh my god, no, no, no. I don't want to fight them. I want pick a board. Okay, of course, I guess where the story... Oh, they... There they are again. Ah, it's not here. Right. No, 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 no. I'm faster than you. I must be faster than you. Ah! Okay. Uh, uh... 
Where is it? Ah, oh, here. Oh. I'll show you the beauty Whoa, of my yeah. spear work. Clear off. The threat man. Man. A complete victory. Oh, of course, against Pikachu. Oh my God! Oh my God! Wh which way? Which way? So I go back and then come back. How many they want? Three? Ah, no way. She said. No, that was. That was additional. The throw sand to their eyes. That's additional. Oh, girl. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. You didn't say. Okay. I didn't open the map, these places. So I need to hunt for them from, from the place that I just came from. Most of you have been gone, you know? This is a private moment. It's, it's kind of like using the bathroom, but searching picker boards. Okay, I saw them. But I don't want the barrel. Bar shoot! There. I'll finish this now. Did you just hit me? Not even worth my time. Okay, this should be enough. Huh? What's wrong? Nothing. I just feel a little sorry for them is all. I hear you. These prickle boars might have all been family. People can be so heartless. Yeah, I'd forgotten this feeling. But what can you do? At the end of the day, we have to eat just as much as they do. Yes, what can you do in this situation indeed? Not even Maggie Louise being herself. No. <laughs> I don't know where you're gonna Luffy's take me. Luffy's waiting for us. We should run on home now. Luffy. It doesn't look like Fee. No. He, they are just blonde. Just because they're there. No, no. Wrong way. Wrong way. Go to the damage. Don't go to the wrong way. You want to see what happened. Then go to the right way. Which I don't have a teleportation immediately to go to the right way. I don't have time for you guys. Oh my god. So, bye. Wait. This is not the right pl Oh god. Damn it. Fuck. Oh, oh, oh. Wait. Yeah. Here. Right? Yeah, yeah, and then here, okay, I'm getting lost, just, oh my god, no, 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 <gasps> bro, the candle, no, 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 wow, Maggie, bro, I'm getting a feeling here, my Maggie will, will be, like, whatever she is. Shopping, hunting, laughing with friends. That was how her life used to be, wasn't it? Yes, it reminds me of my own past. Huh? But wasn't your village... Uh, I'm sorry. It's not your fault. The happy times I shared with my family, I still treasure those memories. And even after the attack, I've still been able to find happiness. Eating a good meal... Making new friends? And falling in love? Yes, falling in... Love? <sighs> Look what you made me say, Bianfu! <laughs> There's nothing to be ashamed of. Most <clears throat> every girl's happiest memories are of her first love, after all. Don't you think there was someone special out there Velvet had feelings for? A first love? Do you really think so? That's enough of that talk, Bianfu. You sound like an old man. No! I'm only 150 years old and already being treated like an old man! <laughs> <laughs> but still, I would like to meet the guy Velvet first fell for. I wouldn't. <laughs> I see. You're a guy. Fee, hold that is fee. Those fee count as normal years 
Or not because he, he's a Malek. Does he? Doesn't he know? Well, it depends, I guess, when he was created. Or he can be like a little brother instinct. I know they did say he was young. Yeah. Little brother instinct. I'm gonna put it like that. Look, guy. Oh my god, it's dark. It's dark. God damn it, I'm gonna die. Dark, it's dark, it's dark, it's dark, it's dark, it's car. Heard the news about your brother. I'm happy for you. So, what's your plan now? You guys are snooping around the village. Yeah, we wanted to check out that shrine too, but we got stopped. Apparently, the Abbey's designated it off limits. If there's a Therian around, it's probably there. I'm going to draw it out. If this is a trap, things may turn violent. Either way, this place is about to get a lot less tranquil. <sighs> the same as everywhere else I've been. You can quit here if you like, but I'm going to keep on fighting the Abbey. And if I try to stop you, you'll insist, I presume. Velvet, no! <laughs> I'll give you one day. Once you've made up your mind, come meet me at the Cape. I'm with him. How tomorrow shakes out depends on what you decide, Velvet. Y your hand. It's. As you can see, I'm a demon. Three years ago, I was the one who attacked this village. And... I don't want to hear it! Demon or no demon, you're still you! Okay, so you're scary! I'll get used to it. I promise, I'll keep it a secret. Let's just live here in the village like we used to, okay? You, me, and everyone else. Nico. That was rather good, Velvet. Yeah. Luffy said gets a gold star for being such a good taste tester, too. Tomorrow, I'll fix you up a nice stew. The book? A book? Oh, the book! Oh my gosh! Hey, is this... It's the original copy of the book on Enominot. And all the pages are here. Velvet. Hey, Fee. Can I borrow your compass real quick? I'll give it right back. Please? Uh, alright. Oh my god. I swear, he really if he broke it... More than anything else. Just like you, he loved to stare out at the sea. Wondering what's on the other side. He wanted to go adventuring someday. Oh, I didn't know that. I bet once he wakes up, you two will be really good friends. So, this is what your life used to be like before everything happened, huh? What's gotten into you? Hmm, maybe I made the pudding a little too sweet. <sighs> Velvet, how do you know what it tastes like? <sighs> I think I'll get myself some shut-eye. But what are you going to do about tomorrow? Mogilu, are there arts that let the caster manipulate dreams? Huh? Dreams? Why? 
There is, yes, an art that requires a certain type of Moloch. It envelops you in a fog and reads your regrets, then traps you in a happy dream. An art that reads your regrets and shows you happiness. I'm going to the Cape. Now? What on earth's gotten into you? Velvet. Oh my god. <gasps> Velvet! Don't go. Stay here. Stay with me. Don't you? Uh, yeah, take the compass. You shoot, shoot. This is Fee's compass. Oh, you tell him, girl. At the book, you got the book. Okay. Just run! I'm sorry. Luffy. No, don't. Wait. Velvet, wait. Don't. Don't leave me here. Fog. <laughs> is this what Mogilu was talking about? We're going to the Cape Shrine. It's time to drag out the Therian. That, oh my god. And that's why she appeared in the fog with a dream. And she told us about the dream. That this is a dream, reality dream. Oh, everybody is making sense. Where is the... Uh. Velvet! There you are. Velvet, you have to stop your friends. They keep saying they're going to the Cape, and they just won't listen. The Abbey's forbidden anyone from going inside. We'll all be punished if anyone breaks the rules. And why do you do one? We can kill you, guys. I hate to say it, Nico, but I think I'm a terrible person. I really thought I could have my old life back again, and I could forget everything else. I tried to act like I was doing it for Luffy, but it was all for myself. But I can't forget. I shouldn't forget. Luffy is dead. He was murdered without even knowing why. I will never forgive that. Ever! So get out of my way. <laughs> if you don't, I'll devour you again! <clears throat> Velvet, why? Oh, ho, ho. why must you do this? There we go. The truth at last. Okay, there are a lot of truth here. Wing it, wing it. Armor the human. Hey, mind telling me what the hell's going on? It's a trap. Trap, trap, trap. <sighs> Our enemies spun an illusion based on Velvet's dreams. That's a nasty little art. But Velvet saw through it all? She did. But even if it's all a dream, such brutality on her part. Eh, Velvet's always been our brutal poodle. But to shake off the dream by herself, now that's something. Oh, the boundary you. between dreams and reality is demarcated solely by one's own heart. What? I'm saying she's wowie zowie cool beans. Come on, we gotta hurry. <laughs> Thanks, Magilu. Okay, now cloth changing, but for this moment. Yeah, for this moment, kind of like breaking through the dream, you know? It was all a dream. Hell, even if it wasn't. Wait, 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 wait. Let me fix this. 
There Walk. we go. It's an honor to serve. I won't turn back. Are they, what the hell are you? Oh, the hell? Ah, oh, you're like a zombie spirit. Fume, fume, fume. Well, I don't have time for you. Oh my god, I, I wrong way. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. I could have picked him. Oh. Oh, wait, wait. Okay, no, I'm going back. Damn it. Oh, oh damn it. Double damn it. Okay. Oh my god, I cannot see. Okay, now I can see. Take the treasure, just in case. Oh! A foe worth killing! Sorry, Fee. We need to run. We need to freaking run. I'm freaking go there. What? What? What is it gonna be? Okay, okay, okay. I'm like, okay, okay. Do you use Maggie? Okay. Let's wish for the best. Therion, Beast and Finn win. Beast, Finn win. Beast, Finn win. Beast, Beast, Finn win. Ah, Beast, Finn win. Beast, Finn win. Beast, Finn win. <laughs> I'm sorry. Fist. Fin. Win. Beast Fin win. B win. Fin. Beast Fin win. Beast Fin win. Beast, Fin, Fin, Win, Beast, Fin, Win, Beast, Fin, Win, okay, let's see, Win, Beast, Win, Beast, Beast, Fin, Win, A beast win Okay now me Be ah oh, wait Beast Beast Fin Fin I think I got win I got Cyclone Dart and I got Win. Okay. Is it hot or is it just me? I'll stop you! I'll stop you! Deception! Spirit release! You wronged me! Here's your justice! Binding order! Is it hot or is it just me? I know you. I'll stop you. Deception. Four four. 
Disruption. Okay, we're gonna need you to interfere with the enemy arts. Interfere with the enemy arts. I'll stop you. Disruption. Four four. Four. What? Come, vengeance! I'll stop you! Deception! I'll stop you! Deception! I'll stop you! Deception! Here it comes! Here it comes! Pyro! Hell! I'll stop you! 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 Deception! I'll stop you! Deception! I'll stop you! Deception! I'm ready. I'll stop you! Deception! I'll stop you! Deception! Four four! Come! Oh what? Did he heal himself? I'll stop you! Deception! Four four! I'll stop you! Deception! I'll stop you! Deception! Shock drum! Damn it! Come! Vengeance! I'll what? What? I'll stop you! I'll stop you! Lightning, rain down! I'll stop you! Hey, hey, hey. I'll stop you! I'll stop you! Deception! Blade, pierce true! Throwing black red wire no escape! Where is the thing? Oh. Void wire! I'll stop! I'll stop you! Deception! This thin air. Air. But wait. Wait, wait. I got bees here. Where is it? Bees. Bees thin air. Air. Clear path. There it is. Inspiration. Is it hot or is it just me? No escape. Die. Crap fire. No escape. Crap fire. Ready to die? Think you can dodge? Just try! Perfect mayhem! No escape! No block! There it is! No escape! Die! No escape! Too slow! No escape! You're wide open! Bird! Die or be killed! No escape! You're wide open! Burn! Die or be killed! No escape! We're on top! Dark and light! No escape! Die! You're wide open! Burn! No escape! You're wide open! Burn! No escape! Not good! How could this happen? There oh, it is! Are you dead? Oh. Crushing weight! Is it hot or is it just me? No escape!
escape! Die! No escape! First circle. No escape! We'll Die! Rain down! No escape! You're wide open! Burn! No escape! Too slow! No escape! No escape! Hey! No escape! No escape! Ready to die? Think you can dodge? Die. Just try! Perfect mayhem! No escape! Die! Will you be a dog? Sorry, pups. You're coming with me. Velvet! It's okay. I killed their owner. I deserve all their oh, hate. Oh, the two and dogs! Then some. But not now. Understand? Once I get my revenge, you can tear me apart if you like. I promise. Until then, I'll need your help. Guess the art finally evaporated. The book! It disappeared! Oh, what it book? was a dream. I found a copy of the ancient book with every page still intact. It was in Velvet's house. Artorias's book! The real one might still be there. We should go back to Velvet's house to search for it. Teleport there, don't make me walk. We got two dogs. That was one hell of an illusion. I have to admire the skill that went into its construction. The caster probably has a tethered Moloch with a unique power on the same level as my Reaper's Curse. I can think of one person who would lay such a wicked trap. Illusion. Still, we may have a new clue to the nature of Inominat. You found Inominat's book, right, Lafayette? Yeah, in Velvet's house. Then let's hurry to Velvet's house. Well, there, there's somebody there waiting for me. Uh, uh, uh. I was going to do all right equipment. Okay, we good here. I know it's mastered, but at this point, I do need like. A little of strength, not a little, a lot of strength. So I'm gonna a little bit ignore the max stuff going on. I need to run. There's nobody here. This is reality. Hey, you never know. Wow. That wicked guy. So we got all the Therians, I, I guess. Oh, we can't later. Let me see if I find uh, my house. Hey, let's see if I find my house. Let's see if I found the book in my house. Maybe. Unless Arthurus was like, ah, I'm gonna take this.
Oh. It's empty. No surprise there. Artorius is too thorough to overlook something like that. If only I'd showed it to you as soon as I found it. Don't beat yourself up over it. We wouldn't have been able to read it without Grimoire anyhow. It was just a dream. All of it. This was your room, wasn't it? You can knit? I was trying to learn. Nico said she'd teach me how as a thank you for giving her my quiche recipe. We wanted to finish a set of scarves for the winter. Velvet. Forget about it. I don't need to knit anymore. Okay, right, no. The kitchen? Check out all these complicated looking books. A hand drawn map! Nice. It's incomplete, but seems quite detailed. It's beautiful. My brother drew it every day. Even when his fever got too strong for him to read a book, he'd stare at that map for hours. Laffy said he, he wanted to travel the world? Yes, it was his dream. I never understood what made him want to do something so dangerous. But I'm living his dream now. It's ironic, isn't it? Those are the graves of my sister and her son. He died before he was even born. They're in rough shape. We should lay some flowers. Don't bother. There's no point. A keen insight. Eating one would be cruel enough, but plucking an innocent flower just to offer it as decoration for some memorial. That's not even a sacrifice, just a cruelty devoid of all purpose. Melchior! As obtuse as ever. I take it you're the one behind the dream fog? I must say, you did well to break for such resolve. If you weren't a Therian, I'd be tempted to take you under my wing. Did you come here to flatter me? Indeed. Although I was already in the neighborhood to retrieve this book. I'll be taking that. This book was compiled by my dear friend, who was also Artorius's mentor and predecessor as head of the Exorcists. It contains the hopes and dreams left by a noble soul, who gave his life for the world that grieved him. It is not for a tainted demon to touch. Like we need your permission! <laughs> Look who obeyed me for once. Is that... you didn't! Be patient. You'll know everything before long. What we seek is the realization of a perfect Wait. order, as tranquil and beautiful as a wildflower in bloom. A perfect order? Let's go. There's nothing left for us here. It was... the captain, no? <gasps> Did he make Ifrit Ivf a demon Malik? Right, of course, of course. Oh! Look! It's the Book of Enominot! What's it doing there? Wait! That's one of Arthur's! Actually, it's a copy that Lafayette made. Lafayette made a copy of the book. <sighs> he transcribed it all by hand, and then he sold it, just to buy me that comb. There was something here for us after all. Lafayette. If that's the complete manuscript, we might be able to unravel Enominot's secrets. We'll have to show it to Grimoire. 
<laughs> Pulling one over on the old man, are you? Never a dull moment with Lady Calamity around. For a moment I thought that laugh was... a bad laugh. All right. Time to drop off the pups and get Grimoire to translate this book. We're going back to Titania. He's here, right? Where am I? Morgan... F no, it's the... It's the other way, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, oh my god. Dude. That horned monster. He was with Melchior. There was something different about him. He wasn't a Moloch, though, right? <sighs> yeah. I'm pretty sure he's a demon. But why would the Abbey be working with a demon? He could be a Therian, maybe. I mean, there was Medissa and Kamoana. No, I don't think so. The Abbey keeps their Therians behind barriers and bound to Earth Pulse points. A Therian can't send malevolence to Inominat while walking freely. That's correct. And besides, Orthrus was already here. In any case, now we know Melchior has a mean-looking bodyguard in addition to his illusions. That'll take quite a lot to stop him. Aye. That's a fact. Dude, and now I'm waiting for... Magilu connection. Per se. That guy. But that guy doesn't say anything to Magilu, you know? You know, of course you know. But that, what I'm seeing is kind of like... He doesn't say anything. Of course, he see her. Oh, they can ignore Magilu, but... You get me. Wait, why I cannot go? Because there is water. Really? Can we walk on water? Is in that deep? Love you guys. But really, it's just water. You could have walk. Don't tell me. Okay. It's don't ah uh, because ah uh, because this is lying. Excuse moi, excuse moi. Eleanor, there's something I have to ask. What is it? Did you leak our plans to the Abbey? <gasps> Eleanor hasn't done anything like that. Then how do you explain Melchior and his illusions already waiting for us when we got to a ball? I promised you that I would work together with you until I found the truth for myself. I'm not up to any tricks. It's far too late for that now. Exactly what a guilty party would say. If anyone's suspicious here, I'd say it's you, Magilu. <laughs> no tricks. <laughs> I don't even know what a trick is. <sighs> Enough. If Eleanor was leaking information, then Titania would surely be under attack by now. Right. I'm sure the Abbey would love to have those Therians back. But the enemy was in that village waiting in ambush. The Abbey isn't foolish. They figured out by now that we're rounding up the Therians. They'll have left traps for us with each remaining one. It's the obvious move. All right. If that's how you see it, I'll stand down. So you trust me then? No. <gasps> I'm saying that anything the Abbey tries, I'll be ready for it. <sighs> oh, such a brave, determined soul. Eleanor, does the Abbey possess an art that can control demons? Not that I've ever heard of. Besides, if they could control demons, there'd be no need to resurrect Enominot, would there? Can't argue with that. But Melchior was obviously in control of that demon. How did he manage that? You can't tether them like a Moloch, and Melchior wasn't using oaths or mana to compel him. No, this was something more like mind control. Mind control? Let's say you know your target's innermost desires. You simply conjure the right illusion. Show them what would push their buttons in just the right way. Ah, if you can create an illusion of something someone really wants, you can control them. Exactly. You can force a powerful burden upon your target's psyche. Until their spirit breaks, that is. What happens when they break? Depends on the target. They might become an empty shell, they might go wild with desire. Eeny teeny spiny crow. You sure know a lot about this. Now that you put it that way, why would I know so much about it? 
What if someone is controlling me, making me say these very words? How horrifying! <laughs> I believe I'll take your words with a grain of salt. Hmm. <clears throat> yeah, like Milo. Watch out for Milo, or not watch out for Milo, but whoever made Milo, I love you. And I'm waiting for her, her everything, you know. It's gonna be amazing. No, no, don't touch me. No, no, don't, no touching. No. No, to no touching. Oh my god. Listen, Eleanor really isn't spying on us. I was with her almost every minute, and when I wasn't, Velvet was watching her. And she's a woman who keeps her promises. She wouldn't lie to... Lafayette. We understand, Lafayette. It's Eleanor. If she were lying to herself to somehow keep spying on us, the guilt would fill her with malevolence. I see. You're right. The fact that I haven't turned into a dragon proves that. Thank you. Both of you. I didn't <clears throat> think you were giving them information intentionally. But there are illusionists like Melchior out there. That means we can't rule out someone recording your thoughts in secret. I don't think we need to worry about that either. Not with you and Lafayette always near. <sighs> now that that's settled, it's time for you all to testify to my innocence. That could be difficult. What? Well, okay. Why don't you start off by telling us all about the time you sold us out to Teresa back in Helleviz? Oh, why bring up that old yam? You're a very vindictive man, do you know that? You're just figuring that out? <laughs> well, there's your proof, at least. You wouldn't make much of a spy. <laughs> she really wouldn't. Hey, that's not what I meant! You were mean! <laughs> <laughs> what the... I was going to say something. The crystal ball. The crystal ball was just for the message of Arthur? Or was for something more? Huh. Did the crystal ball enter into me? I think it was just to sending the message to Arthur because the crystal ball just got out and she followed it and that was it. Okay, we got another till here, so guys, thank you so much for watching and see you next one. If you guys want. And All the lights are passing by And all my thoughts, they multiply I see it flash before my